Hey everyone, welcome back to Of Ash and Dust. In today's episode, we are going to be picking it up from the catacombs. I said in the end of the last episode that I think I'm just going to drop down. Uh, and I think that's exactly what I'm gonna do. See, but this is risky though, because... Here's what I'm thinking. And I mentioned this before. There is a 0% chance, oh shit, nice, that pinwheel is not gonna have a twist. I'm like anticipating him being the hardest fucking boss in the game or something like that. Knowing how they play it. So going in here with three Estus flasks uh, is probably going to be a little... Li what? I hate bone wheels. I hate bone wheels. Should I, you know what the issue is? The issue is that I do not have um, homeward bones. It's a bit stupid of me to not buy any. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna have to bite the bullet and pop a twin Hume and kindle this bonfire. Yeah, we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to. Again, just I, I have a feeling that uh, pinwheel is gonna have some some sort of twist mm, and I don't want to risk it so anyways yeah um, <clears throat> if you're watching this you'll probably notice that today is Saturday which is supposed to be the kind of slot for the Saturday stream oh, yeah, yeah, okay Leroy is still here. That's nice. Um, yeah, this is supposed to be the slot for the Saturday stream. You can probably hear that I'm not that sick anymore. But here's the deal. If you've been keeping up with the Kardashians, which is my stream, uh, you'll know that I finished the Dark Souls 2 playthrough. So I'm going to be starting a new playthrough, which... There's no like... Oh, fuck. I don't have one, do I? Yeah, I, I don't think so. I, I don't think I do. <clears throat> Man, that would be nice. I think I wasted a coin somewhere. That was the issue. Um, The, the game I'm going to be playing is Ashen. And here's the deal. Like, I'm starting a new game, a new series, a new stream. I want to be like 100% when I started, you know, like fully, fully into it. And I'm still coughing occasionally. <coughs> Perfect example there. Still blowing my nose. but So I like want to be make sure that I'm like fully ready, fully engaged, because that's how that's the best way to play a new game. Oh, fuck off. Cool. He has a lot of HP. Oh, but the things... That takes damage too. You saw the, the bone wheels, killing the bone wheels damaged him as well. Okay, maybe this is not gonna be that difficult. Maybe not even the mod makers can make this boss difficult. I mean, this is a good twist, I will admit it. So they kind of work like the... Um, the skeleton lords. He's not taking a lot of damage from pyromancers, that's the thing. Sorry, Pinwheel. You were still kind of a bitch. I was expecting something. May oh, giant dead mask. Nice. -o. I know this is a meme, 
and we don't do I never do <laughs> okay <laughs> yeah cool you know Dark Souls memes and all are good but let's keep it serious here this is a, a serious serious channel as you know I don't even remember what the fuck I was talking oh yeah Ashen and being like 100% and all that so that's the reason I am like Oh, fuck off. What the hell? Seriously? 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 The range, though. Oh, is this gonna be Shrine of Amana? I think this is gonna be Shrine of Amana. I have, like, no light source. And I just realized that it might have been stupid to come here first. Um, because I was really hoping that was going to be a coin. Yeah, it might have been pretty stupid to come here first. Because... Well, you know. Okay, bro, you, I, I don't have anything to give you. What? Wait, what? I had one? Why did I think I didn't have one? Oh, it takes you to the un nice Lifesaver. Thanks for coming through random bronze coin that I like, I don't know, fished out of my... Oh, okay. Probably fished it out of my, like, asshole or something. So, that's gonna make things a lot better. Yeah, I don't know why I thought of going to the Berg first, not the Berg, what am I talking about, the Catacombs first. I know what I need, I need to get Cast Light, because I think I should have the stats to use Cast Light, the Int I mean, I mean 16 Int I'm pretty sure is okay for that, so... We need to get Dusk. But Dusk wasn't... That's the problem with like everything being remixed. Sometimes you like... Don't know what the fuck to do. Because <clears throat> we also need like the very large Ember. We also need to go to Sif's place. The Undead Asylum. You know what? Okay, here's the deal. Let's go to the Undead Asylum again. I want to check the place out. I feel like... At least get the Peculiar Doll or something like that. I'm going to get this thing up to... Plus 10. That was a lot of souls, but... I felt like that was worth it. We'll see if that actually remains true. Anyways, yeah, let's go. Let's go to the Undead Asylum, because why not? And then I, like, gotta fucking find Dusk somehow. Get Cast Light. And then that should be okay for the Catacombs. Or Tomb of Giants, whatever. This means I also should be able to... I missed it. I also should be able to um, unlock... The... What's her name? The Quailag sister. That also gives you pyromancy. It's Quailana, I think. Pokey pokey. Whatever. God, that was a miss. This is the walk of shame. This is, you know, I've I've done this a couple of times. Like when you fall down and you're running back, this is absolutely the walk of shame. So that's why I'm sitting here in silence because uh, this shit is. 
Well, you know, you know, you you don't you don't make all your jumps in life. Just how it is. This is why I'm moonlighting as a motivational speaker. You know. Question is, is that the key? Because if that's not the key, I'll need to do another walk of shame. Fuck it. We're taking a risk here. F2 West. Adam West. How the fuck do you get there though? Oh! I got you. You drop from here. That's a bitching item there as well. How I missed a oh, fucking Zweihander. How do you make that? By being a professional Mario Dark Souls player. Listen, I've played Sekiro. I know how to I know how to jump. Oh by the way, people have been asking which fuck I'm behind on answering my comments. Sorry guys. I saw the Elden Ring trailer leaks. That shit is looking good. That shit is looking good. I don't remember if there was like a rumored uh, release date yet or not. But man, that sucks. Like me not being able to get a PlayStation 5 and Elden Ring. Hopefully you don't need something special for this. Um, just checking my time. Cool, you don't. Um... Not being able to get a PlayStation 5 is making me real worried because Elden Ring be looking nice. And I'm worried that it's gonna like drop or something and I'm gonna be shit out of luck. <laughs> nice, it's just dead eyed and <clears throat> not a care in the world. Totally chill with the crow. I need to get a different hood or like headpiece because it doesn't match. That's kind of an issue. I don't like it when things don't match. Fashion Souls is key. So yeah, the Elden Ring trailer is looking hella, hella awesome. To put it lightly. And I'm like really kind of looking forward to it because it's like they've been silent on it for so long that it's kind of ridiculous. And to have like something, to have some info. You know, with the open world, they said that they're like, I mean, obviously everything I'm saying is leaks, but I think they were saying that um, the game is going to have some climbing mechanic similar to Sekiro, which is actually pretty cool. I was thinking that as well, that it needs, uh, maybe not like, you know, jumping around on walls and shit. Fuck off. So this is unchanged, basically, from what I've seen so far. <clears throat> Why did I do that? Ouch. Um, so yeah, he's gonna have like a climbing mechanic, um, all that. I think they were, the leaks even said something on stealth, which is a bit crazy, because, you know, Sekiro had stealth, but it wasn't the most complex thing. So it's cool, it's cool, I'm like really looking forward to it. I'm wondering how much kind of influence George R. R. Martin is gonna have. That motherfucker for sure ain't finishing Winds of Winter. Um, he's messing around with Elden Ring. But I'm wondering what like the tangible effect is gonna be. Because I know he's like writing lore. 
I think that's the main... That's the main thing. What a bitch is. The question is, is this still gonna contain Titanite Shard? No. Is this still gonna contain the ring? The rusted iron ring. Oh, it's a peculiar doll. Nice. So, picking up that key was worth it. But then the question is, what is down there? If it ain't the doll. We're gonna find out. That's a surprise. Probably shouldn't back myself into the corner like an idiot, but then again, we have Paris. Told you, we have Paris. The rest of that shit don't even matter. I should fight the stray demon, I think. It's looking very ominous, no longer like waddling around. Oh shit, this is Crest Shield. And this is unlocked, this wasn't unlocked before. Somebody's doing like some prison break shit. Okay, this is not an interactable one. Miracle con Congregation. Well, let's just have a look. A depressing miracle with no affiliation with any covenant or land. Conge conjures a companion from the remnant of the surrounding area to fight for you. This cell was created by the dying wish of a lonely cleric starved for food, yet only seeking companionship in his final moments. Interesting. It's like a little buddy. The Buscadors attempted to suppress the gods. Suppress. Suppress. Serpa, I can't even read. I can't even talk. Holy weapon. Restores HP with each hit. The miracles are looking interesting in this game. And pyromancy, we had one new pyromancy so far. Which is that little bomb thing. Which was in the other games too. But that wasn't like anything major. <clears throat> so I think the boss is... The boss is what's next. And... Six Estus. I'm not sure they can do a twist with this guy. Or I would like struggle to think of one. For sure. So I'm gonna confidently... Take him on. Shit. He has mucho HP. Oh, this guy always kind of has a lot of HP, doesn't he? Come on, stop that shit. Is he just gonna keep spamming that? Fuck. Hey, hey. gonna rebuff what am I talking about the weapon buff is a new pyromancy as well I just realized probably because it's like so integral to my playstyle that I don't even notice it
What the fuck? Oh fuck, that was a mistake. I accidentally hit square. I know DSP, DSP, right? I wonder what's going on with DSP. Probably same thing as always. I'm a secret DSP fanboy, you know. That's the... I manage the fan club. The only fans account. So, you know. I keep busy. Fire to your crotch. Okay, nothing special. Just what you normally get from this guy, right? Uh, when did I start recording? I think we still got time. Yeah, that was a cool area. But not much, not much changed here. It's the location of the items. I guess there's a good enough twist because most people do not pick up the rusted iron ring. Um, but I anticipated. I anticipated this turn of events. And the question is, what the fuck do we do from here? Because, like, dusk, dusk really is the key, and I might do a little Google foo after this episode to find out where the hell she is. Because I feel like I feel like she should be back where she normally is, but I don't know. Because I, rem I remember where her summon thing is. But, you know, that's something different. <clears throat> I thought it was... <laughs> I thought that wasn't gonna be possible. Like, the crow is gone and just fucking leaves you here. Alright. That would have been a twist, and it's game over, you go hollow. That's it. I like the light here. Bit of a drop. Sorry, Petrus. You're lucky I didn't like plunging attack your ass. You deserve it. Um. Uh, Let's go with strength. We need strength for the great sword of Artorias. In fact, I'm gonna go ahead and pop a couple of souls. Let's see if this gives you one gives me one more level. Hell yeah it does. You know where it's going. Hmm. Hmm 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 hmm. Homeward Bones. Who sells Homeward Bones? There's a little merchant lady here. I'm hoping she does. I'm really hoping. Is there a harder to come by in this game? Oswald definitely does. And I'm an idiot for not having bought more when I was there. Anyways, we'll check this out. And after that, we are going to... Do I have the Crest of Artorias? I do. I have no idea when when or where I got it, but... Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... We're gonna go there. Please, 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 please. Oh, yes. I have two of them? Shit. Alright, now I have six. And the... The only thing that's difficult to keep track of is where and how each of the gravestones connect. Because I definitely have one that leads to the church. 
but I don't remember what the connection is. Probably just easier to walk there. <clears throat> so that's what I'm gonna do. Because none of these ones in Firelink Shrine are unlocked. I'm thinking that these might transport you from the four, because I'm pretty sure there's four of them here. So they might just bring you in from the boss areas. You know, like the four lords areas. <clears throat> God, the boots don't match either. Uh, we're gonna need... Some Chad Black Iron Leggings? Hell no. Interesting that this game... I think this game <coughs> cut out uh, mid-rolling as well. Okay, we can go with Artorias's. Makes your legs look like super, super skinny. A little bit weird looking, actually. Those are some thin-ass legs, boys. Definitely skipped leg day, so... That shit. That ain't it, chief. But these ones make you look really thick. Some thick legs now. Whatever. Actually, I think I like the look of... The Artorias leggings a little bit more. What a bruh. Do you sell homeward bones? No, you don't. So what I think I'm going to do is I'll go... There was a bonfire somewhere. Yeah, like pretty much cosplaying as an Artorias fanboy right about now. Anor Londo. Oh, it goes from Anor Londo. Okay. They don't have anything from Blight Town. And Artorias' set looks so cool. Maybe just going helmetless would be like. Yeah, I think I like the look of that the best. <coughs> Can I put on the gloves though? Got it. Yeah, we're going full Artorias fanboy here. Probably once I get his sword I won't be able to like... Use it so freely. But for now, let's fanboy it up. And of course, like the dinky ass fucking shield doesn't help either. I'm gonna go in here and check something because... I'm pretty sure that this is where you can feel the presence of a... Yeah. Free the princess of Ulusil. I would, man. I would, I would free her if I knew where she was. Oh, I remember where the bonfire is up there. Cool. Let's see what's up in this area. Oh, do they have buffs as well? Fuck. I hear like... Oh, <laughs> I know this. <laughs> this is fucking Oro. Right? Is that a falchion? With uh, Dark Moon? I think it is. Elite Knight. This is Oro. Am I gonna get lag stabbed or something? Shit, you still have HP? I thought you were dead. No, no, no. That was pretty cool. I see what you're doing, game. I see what you're doing. Oh, 
Oh shit. Damn. It's like rapid firing. Fucking Hawkeye up in here. She's running, running like a bitch too. Okay, this is gonna be difficult. Man, these these fucking plants are incredible in this mod. They're so annoying. The most annoying enemy. Okay, I need to wrap up soon. Yeah. I feel like archery would be a viable tactic if you could shoot it that quickly. Oh, come on. Fighting a fucking zoner. It looks like the falchion is like the favorite weapon around these parts. God, you're so annoying. Back you in the corner now. Oh, you're gonna get so well. What is it? Id. I don't have the gesture. Point down then. Quickly. Cool. Um, this is an interesting area. Between humanities and the Ferris. Ferris stuff, not Ferros. I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here. Here in the forest. Um, with three Estus. Which means I should probably go back. I'm like honestly hoping these guys don't respawn. Mr. Falchion Oro. Yeah, if you enjoyed this video, as always, make sure to give it a like, comment, subscribe if you're new here, turn on post notifications. I'm like keeping my eyes peeled here. Yeah, we're gonna have to go back. Like, there's no way I can get through this with three Estes. Um, I might just kindle it as well, this bonfire. This is cool though, cool place. I feel like we made some okay progress. Uh, I really need to get dust though, so. Google time. Thanks for watching. Take care and goodbye. Peace out.